Here's a great tip that I learned at like an internet, how to internet market workshop or on book or something like that. It was all on implementation, right? And it was like, how do you implement a new idea, right? First, you set a deadline. Number two is get help. And then number three, you set a system so you don't need to come back. So in your painting process, this might be something you want to do, like use more paint, or you might want to, what, like use looser brushwork. It could be anything, right? Anything that you want to achieve in your paintings. So here's how you do it, is you set a timeline for when you want to establish this thing. And it could also be like you want to get a, it doesn't necessarily have to be about painting, it could also be about marketing your art, right? Like let's say you want to build a blog or you want to start selling on eBay or you want to try to submit to magazines or submit to galleries. Anyway, how do you implement something new? First, you set a deadline, right? So you pick a date and you put it far enough in the future that it is going to be manageable but still close enough that you're still going to be excited about doing it, right? So not too far, but then again, make it realistic. Number two, probably the most important thing is get help. Analyze it, break it down to all the steps that you're gonna need to do in order to achieve this, right? And then get help for the steps that you don't know how to do. Just ask people for help and they'll help you. People are great about that, you know? If they know how to help you, they will. And if four people say no, the fifth one will say, yeah, sure, I'll help you. No problem, let me help you with that because someday they'll help you with it or somewhere along the way someone helped them with something and they feel you know that that's just the way the world should work we help each other out and then number three you set a system so you don't need to come back so it is in place and it stays in place right so for example let's say you're going to put paintings on ebay right one of the systems i did for that was i created an eBay auction, a real nice looking auction, and then I saved as a template. So, and I had all of the things I needed to change at the very top of the auction. So then when that auction was over, then, you know, I had, I ran them from Sunday to Sunday. Those were the best days, by the way. Then what I did was I, um, the auction was over, I hit list a similar object, I changed up the pictures, changed up the title, and boom, I could put an auction up in three minutes. So that's what I'm talking about. Figure out some way to automate it so that once you've implemented this, then it stays implemented, okay? Now, as far as changing your painting style, you might develop some sort of a checklist or have a sign in your studio that you make sure you check every day or set a timer so that it goes off every four hours when you're painting or every two hours or every hour or every 15 minutes and says, hey, check to make sure you're using more paint. Okay, that's Dan with another tip of the week. Kind of a different tip, but really is an important thing. Have a great day.